thief. What's this? Old manifest. Lots of treasure. Captain Avery. You've certainly seen better days. What do you got? The battalion money. It says Avery sigil on it. Mm -hmm. Must have melted down the gold, minted his own currency. So based on that, all the manifests on the shelves, the treasure was here. Yeah. Leaves the bigger question. Where is it now? Okay. So we know that there was fighting outside. Yeah, Dan, inside. What do you think the colonists stole it? No. I think they were trying to reclaim what was theirs. Look, there's Avery, two. Founders of Libertalia. All marked with the word thief. Not murderer, not tyrant. Thief. So by the time the colonists busted in here, Treasure was already gone. Yeah, because these guys had already taken it for themselves. Pirates will be pirates, right? Uh, pirates will be pirates. Huh. I know where they moved it. What? Where? Oh, that's a map. Yeah, right there. That's our treasury. It's a map of Libertalia. All right, so follow it to the other side of the island and look. Right there. New Devon. Avery was from Devon, England. He sure was. Man, those are some seriously large mansions. Each of them has its own sigil, too. Because that's where they lived. <laughs> what do you say we uh, climb that watchtower, huh? Get our bearings. New Devon, here we come. Okay, ready? Okay, that's step one. Step two. Raise the chandelier. Good idea. <laughs> Sounds surprised. Just take the compliment. The place is looking classy. Let's get up there. Excuse me. Oh, sorry, Condon. Baldridge. What? You're stepping on Baldridge. Oh, so I am. Shock the stairs are intact. Hey, hey, hey. Don't jinx us. Oops. Spoke too soon. <laughs> like I said. Nathan, <laughs> you seeing this tower? Sure am. Sam? Yeah? All right, just making sure you haven't plummeted to your death. <laughs> just about there. <laughs> he sure is excited. Need a lift? I love a lift. Come on, ready? Ready. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh. Quite the crow's nest, huh? There it is. Just on the other side of the river. Now, what do you say we go? Rob from the rich, huh? Hey, is there a path down there? Uh, of sorts. Come on. So, how long do you figure it'll take us to get the new Devon? Well, a couple hours. Depends on what or who we bump into along the way. Try this again. you on about? Oh, it's my safe word. Mm. Are you always this clever? Uh, have my moments. Yes. You and your brother have proven yourselves the more capable treasure hunters on the island. Shame we're not on the same side. Hey, there's, there's still time. Trust a trick. Mm. I'm not falling for that again. Hey, hey, just, just let's talk about this. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, that was a bit rougher than expected. I'll just uh, see myself out. After everything, you think I'm just going to let you walk away? That'd be the wise thing to do. Come on, Nadine, really? We know you're a badass and all, but there's two of us. I don't think my men are on their way here right now. All I have to do is buy some time. That's if I don't finish it myself. God damn it. Go! <laughs> I'm tired of your brother! And I'm tired of you! I know you don't! Get fucked! 
Fast, but you're not that fast. Hey, forget about her. Come on, we gotta get out of here before they. Shit. Whoa, 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 whoa! Everybody, just, just calm down, okay? Well, this is interesting. Nate, Samuel, put your guns down, all of you. No. Rafe, this guy's on edge. Oh, don't worry about him, Nadine. These guys don't kill anyone in cold blood. It's just not their style. You wanted to bet her life on that? Go ahead, then. Shoot her. Sam. I die, you both die. So be it. Not another step! You mean... like this? Sam, put the gun down. I warned you. Do it! Rafe! It's done! Hold your fire! Don't shoot! Put it down. It's done. Okay? It's done. Don't worry, Nadine. It's not their style. I say, I didn't think he had it in him. <laughs> Samuel. You okay? I guess you knew this moment was coming, huh? Hey! <laughs> Come on, man. You already got us. Take it easy. Come on, now you're a businessman. Let's just, just work out a deal. Oh, a deal? Oh, yeah. I'd love to hear what you have in mind. Oh, you can go ahead. I'm listening. I just. I... You want to find Avery's treasure? We'll help you find it. And in exchange, I let you live? Yeah. That and a small cut. The gout shows on this guy. Just enough to get him his freedom, okay? His freedom? Nathan. Yeah. He did hard time. Our time. And the guy who broke him out, Hector Alcazar, he owes him a lot of money. Whoa. What the hell are you talking about, Nate? Hector Alcazar died in a shootout in Argentina like six months ago. I'm the one that got Samuel out. Oh. Wow. What did he tell you? Sam, what kind of story did you cook up? Alcazar? Really? You lied. You lied to your baby brother. We're wasting time. Just a second. Thing is, Nate, I never stopped looking for Avery's treasure. I just kept running into these dead ends. <laughs> and then I hear that our dear old Samuel Drake, an authority on Avery, is alive and somewhat well. There was no breakout. I bribed the prison warden, and your brother, he just waltzed right out the front gate. He spent the last two years tracking down a second St. Dismas Cross. You know what? He did it all with me. No. Oh, yeah? No, that's bullshit. Oh. Sam, care to refute? Nate. Oh, Sam. Jesus, no, no. Listen, Avery's treasure was ours. It was always ours. I left my light for you. <laughs> hey, look, look, Nate, if it's any consolation, he duped me too. He pulled a Houdini on me, he brought you and that old man back into the mix, and I cannot lie, Sam, that really pissed me off. But, <clears throat> all behind us now. You don't deserve it. You do? 
Last I checked, we're all a bunch of thieves digging around where we shouldn't. Wraith? What? One way or another, end it. Or I will. Well, you heard the lady. Hey, you missed one clue, and you can kiss that treasure goodbye. You said it yourself. Keep running into dead ends. Why don't you face it, Rafe? You need us. No, you're right. You're half right. I just need Sam. Wait, now you're making a mistake. Don't, don't, you don't, don't here anyway. I have no idea. But this is definitely the address. I've been scoping the place out. No one's home. <sighs> and here we are. Whoa. This place is humongous. <laughs> Where do we even start? Well, we start by finding a way in. And then we can take the grand tour. You think this place has an alarm? Let's try and find a way in that doesn't involve breaking a window. All right, there you go. I can't jump that high. Follow me. Come on, Nathan. Whoa. Spooky. Oh, here. I brought a spare. So, are we looking for any particular room? Uh, just keep an eye out for any books, journals, any kind of research papers, you know? be in this attic. The boxes are filled with old traveling and camping equipment. Down we go. So, how do we find them? What, Mom's notebook? I know you remember? She always used that off-white leather binding. Yeah, I know, but... It's such a large place. It's like finding a needle in a haystack. <laughs> Here we go. White leather. Sam, I think I found one. For real? No. It's not one of Mom's. You got the right idea, though. Let's keep looking.
Was this your house? Hey, these boxes remind you of anything? Every place we ever lived. Exactly. I remember Dad was always like, why bother unpacking? We're just gonna move again in a month. Yep. Always the asshole. Hey, Sam. Call me crazy, but this looks like a Ming Dynasty vase. Nathan, who in their right mind would have a Ming Dynasty vase just sitting around like that? Yeah. It's probably a knockoff of some kind. Yeah, of course it is, right? Right. Pledge. Here, let's do it together. You ready? Push! 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 What the hell? It's some sort of sarcophagus. Yeah. Look around. This whole place is filled with sarcophaguses. Or sarcophagi. Damn, this is real. What is this place? Well, let's go find out. 